It's still Vice One News with me, Akua Santibamis. And still on our local stories, some residents of Inchaban in the Shama district have expressed disappointment that feedback they give to district authorities and companies operating in the areas are disregarded. The resident who spoke to Vice One News during a community dialogue made possible by the Western Regional Coastal Foundation said although a platform has been created for them to air their concerns, the relevant authorities have turned a deaf here. In response to concerns arising from the start of commercial production of oil offshore, the Western Regional Coastal Foundation was set up with support from the UK aid to promote transparent dialogue between locals and public private institutions. The foundation uses public dialogue platforms to collect views of locals and seek answers and solutions from responsible public private institutions. However, residents of Inchaban, speaking at one of such forums, complained that responsible state institutions and private companies are simply not concerned about their challenges as they disregard their opinions. We have a lot of challenges here in Inchaban. To start with, our drains are bad, so when it rains, people's homes get flooded. Also, the lack of a library is affecting standards of education here, and our children get poor results in examinations. Again, young people in this area don't have jobs. Companies operating here do employ the indigents, but they prefer outsiders. We don't have a community center in a town as big as in Chaban. Look at where we are holding this meeting. It is shameful. All the chiefs do is to sell the land. They have even sold the cemetery. How do we get land to build a community center? Please help us. Friends of the nation, which has the mandate to facilitate this dialogue, say it has successfully conducted over 60 community-level conversations as well as two district-level conversations in two districts involving over 10,000 residents. The organization says it will make sure the resident disappointments are forwarded to the relevant public-private institutions. When we came here um, earlier, the communities raised issues about their drains, they raised issues about their chips compound, they raised um, issues about uh, employment. So today we are here to provide feedback to those issues that they have raised and also solicit any additional issues that have arisen after our first round of community conversations. Some, some of these concerns are being addressed and are, there are some of them which are also uh, are standing. But it is prudent that with all the issues that have, that have come up, we should come back to the communities to provide feedback and tell them the extent of uh, addressing of these issues and how <coughs> the duty bearers are also willing to address them. A report by Kwasia J. Enim from Inchaban.